World Health Organization defines endometriosis as a disease in which tissue similar to the lining of the uterus grows outside the uterus. According to WHO, endometriosis can start at a person's first menstrual period and last until menopause. Endometriosis affects roughly 10%, which is 190 million of reproductive age women and girls globally. It is a chronic disease associated with severe life-impacting pain during periods, sexual intercourse, bowel movement, chronic pelvic pain, abdominal bloating, nausea, fatigue, and sometimes depression, anxiety, and infertility. Access to early diagnosis and effective treatment of endometriosis is important but is limited in many settings, including the lower and middle income countries. These are the signs and symptoms of endometriosis. Chronic pelvic pain, heavy bleeding during periods or between periods, trouble getting pregnant, bloating or nausea, fatigue, depression or anxiety. These are the causes that can lead to endometriosis. Retrograde menstruation. This is when menstrual blood flows back to the pelvic cavity at the time that blood is flowing out of the body throughout the cervix and vagina during periods. Cellular metaplasia is when cells change from one form to another. Cells outside the uterus change into endometrial-like cells and start to grow. Stem cells can give rise to the disease, which then spreads through the body via blood and lymphatic vessels. WHO says endometriosis has a significant social, public health, and economic implications. It can decrease quality of life due to severe pain, fatigue, depression, anxiety, and infertility. Some individuals with endometriosis experience immense pain that prevents them from going to work or school. According to WHO, there is no known way to prevent endometriosis. Enhanced awareness followed by early diagnosis and management may slow or halt the natural progression of the disease and reduce the long-term burden of its symptoms.